Hey everybody, Cardboard Jesus, really welcome. We're here to do the 2017-18 Upper Deck Hockey Series One, uh, number six. This is all we got. Is all that's left. No moss after this. So if you didn't get in now, you're uh, you're what they refer to as screwed. way. All right, we got all six boxes this time. Jesse forgot to do one box of number five. Like he only opened five boxes of number five. So that one was the sixth box of number five. This one is number six. Gypsy Queen, yes. Matt, I don't have a, an exact number on it. Gelfman's out of town until Wednesday, but I can, I mean, we I mean, we normally get, I mean, a, a case or two of it at minimum. It's not really, I mean, it's not something we break, because it's kind of a pain in the ass to do that, but I mean, we normally have it. So if I, if I do, when I do find out, I'll let you know. I'll tell him. No J.R. Smith Auto. No more Chris Fitz purchases. He ruined it. Ruined it for everybody, even. Moss. Well, thank you, Mr. Dew. It's still like a little bit surreal. Like it's. I don't know. Like I'm still like almost not like 100% convinced that like when I go home, she'll still be there. Like that it was just, you know, like I got her for a little bit. Not anymore, so I don't. I don't know. But I mean, the schedule really hasn't bothered me that much. Like I, I, you know, I prefer. I, I tend to stay up late at night anyway. So like, I will stay awake through her like three o'clock feeding, three or four, because like we have to feed her every three hours. And I, you, you have to wake her up even to feed her sometimes. It's kind of weird. At least, I, I mean, I, did, I didn't know anything about about them. So, you gotta, you gotta wake them up. So I will feed her through like 3 or 4 o'clock. And then go to sleep until... Let the, let the wife get up for like 5 or 6 o'clock feeding. Because she, she normally gets up early anyway. And then I'll sleep till you know, 10 or something, and then we'll trade off. The one thing that I did, I was trying so hard not to have happen, was for her to shit on me. And she did. Like, I know, like, boys, you have to watch out for them, you know, like, squirting on your face because of the, you know, just the way the setup is. You know, Mr. Dew, I think you'd be surprised. I mean, 
I was like the least responsible person that I knew. And I mean, it's like I don't. It's like a sense of purpose. It's like a sense of purpose. They're like I'm up, sterilizing bottles. I mean, the house has probably never been more picked up than it is right now, just for me, you know, doing stuff. I think I've even lost a little bit of weight, even, which is odd. Uh, Nicholas, it is not nothing. Uh, Nothing wonderful. But yeah, the like the first the wife was changing her. And I mean she straight up blasted like all over her shirt. I mean it was I was frankly very impressed at her her ability at such a young age to shoot Shit, nearly a foot and a half. I mean, in a, in a in a perfect stream. Well, see, it's weird because I've been eating like more than I normally do. Because like, you know, everybody's like bringing you know bringing food or you know just oh so I'm I'm, I'm actually maybe that maybe that's part of the problem that I'm actually eating regular meals instead of my uh, you know. Two o'clock McDonald's run. But I'll take it. I mean, I, was, I took, I mean, diapers are like pretty easy to change. I figured out how to put her in her clothes. And beyond that, there's nothing else to it. I figure it's just like smooth sailing from, you know, from here on out. But yeah, I was cleaning her diaper and she straight up pooped right in my hand. I, was, it was, I had to wake the wife up even for a, for a little assistance. I didn't have to, but I did because if I was going to suffer, I figured somebody else should too. No, it, it is, Mr. Dude. It is. And, I mean, really, I've... I mean, the other thing that's been, like, great about it, too, I, is I've played, like, more video games in, like, the past couple of days than I have, like, since she was pregnant. Because when she was pregnant, I was, just, I was always tired. So I would just, like, sleep, like, maximum amounts of sleep. Like, whenever I go to bed, I would just say, screw it, it's 10 o'clock, I'm going to sleep. You know, now I'm staying up till you know four o'clock in the morning. I can I can get in that uh, Assassin's Creed time since she just like sits in her little swing and sleeps. So yeah, Mr. Duke, basically, I mean, just go knock somebody up. That's, I mean, that's really, I think, the answer to the questions we've been asking. Just go knock somebody up. Delbert, thank you. I appreciate it. Cards. A lot of packs. I 
But I'm here. I mean, I very easily could have just quit and become a uh, stay-at-home dad. But I said, no. I'm not going to let Chris Fitz down. I'm not going to let Matt down. I'm not going to do that to Delbert. I'm not going to do it to him. I'd be doing a disservice to the industry if I left. So here I am. Plus, stay at home dad, I I requested like a uh, you know like a salary quote for that, and it was zero. It was zero. Oh, I'm Mr. Daniel. Believe me, there there has to be like a, a time and a place for that. I mean, five years ago, I, I don't think I could have done it. I was not in a place uh, emotionally or mentally to uh, do such things as bring life into this world. The only thing I am, like, struggling with a little bit is being, like, the dick that says, like, you gotta wash your hands before you touch my baby or even, like, look at it. Like, I feel I feel a little bad saying that to people. Like, you should, like, know better than to even, you know, want to touch a baby so young. Or I have to tell you to wash your hands, but I'm getting past that quickly. Mr. Do, since it has been this long since I have seen you, what happened with your medical check? The last time I talked to you, I believe you fainted at a uh, at some type of work work event. Was it at work or a conference or something? You were supposed to be getting checked out. What happened? And I am hoping that it's like low blood sugar. You found out you're hypoglycemic. And you gotta eat more chocolate. And I do, I have a, a Purell on the table closest to her at all times. Although, I'm personally, I don't, I don't love the hand sanitizer. Like, I, I think we do, it might just be, uh, um, uh, what do you call it? You know, like creating super bugs. Wait, do I hey, wait? Say, explain that again, Delbert. That was, uh, I have not forgotten how to open cards, apparently. So I got, I got that going for me. Give me one quick second to do something. Today's the 23rd. And just, uh, you know, in case anybody wants to send gifts or anything, my 10-year wedding anniversary is coming up um, on Friday. Do you, I mean, huh. Poss I mean, po possible migraine? I mean, like, I mean, it would be a very serious migraine, but... Damn. 
I mean, at least everything's coming back clean so far, but that's still, that's scary. Oh, JG, it's, I'm going to have to, like, it's going to take me, like, tomorrow to dig. As, as many piles of stuff as, as I have around, it, it'll be a little bit before I can, before I can locate that. If I have them. All right, Young Gun John Gillies. Gillies. Yeah, but I mean that. See, that's scary too. Cause I mean, it, it means something causes seizures. Right, portrait. Shining stars. Canvas. Another checklist. I'm gonna go with just the team on top. I'm not even a random. John Hayden for the Blackhawks. Terrible beard. Just terrible beard. But you don't have to get a I don't have to Yeah, that was that was a question that I was asking, Andrew. Like It seems unbelievable. Oh, you, I mean, you're not going to get $25,000 for that book, though. There's no, I mean, there's no way. Carter Roney, young guys. I mean, I like six grand, maybe. Five, I mean, five, perhaps. I mean, because Thorpe autos by themselves are like five grand. Grange auto is not that, like, surprisingly not that expensive. I mean, it's it's a nice car, but twenty five. I mean, I, I, don't know. See you later. I have a good night. Seems seems cray cray. I mean, if you can get it, my God, congratulations! Enjoy your new car. Nathan Walker. It's the nicest football card I've ever pulled. And we are finally alone. Yes, I mean, Mr. D, that's my... I mean, what was it? You're, I mean, you, you are more, you know, more skilled at it than I am, but that was, that was my guess. Which is still at a... a an absurd amount of money. Alex Brinkett? Mm, Brinny Cat? Brin Brin Cat Cat? Ooh, a clear cut. I've seen one of these before. Like a uh, clear vision style almost, except this is not Panini. He's a goaltender. It's fancy. I mean, it's actually kind of a cool card. And an Eric Stahl. UD game jersey. Angelo Lovely. The most beautiful thing that's ever been ever been put on this earth. Incredibly sweet, doesn't cry. Only gets like a little bit like you can you can tell she's like a little bit agitated when her diaper's dirty. But otherwise just does not is just straight up. I mean, does this That's two different ones. And that's two different teams. Young Guns Boser. Oh, it's ridiculous, Delbert. 
I mean, the return on investment is insane. And I think Bateson's like a little bit mad at me because he, uh, it was a case that we took from him. Like it was one of his cases. Well, is Angelo, I'm 40. I know I'm 41. So, I mean, you know, I mean, there's not, there's no rush to get into it, but I mean, if when time comes for you, I'm sure that you will be ready and it'll, and it'll be wonderful. All right, who else we got? Travis. Sandheim? Hmm. I'm not gonna pretend to know these uh know these folks. Christian Fisher. I you know listen, age is just a number. I don't feel that old. I don't. I definitely don't act that old. You know, I'm, I'm not having like creaking in my bones or anything yet. So I don't. You know, whatever. I keep I keep assuming that like within my lifetime, you know, medicine will be at a point that. Uh, you know, I'll I'll live into like my one fifties, even with the damage that I have chosen to do to my body. They'll just fix it. Another series one checklist. That's the same one as the other one. I mean, what old fart just sits around playing with cards? Well, I'm going to give her, like, some base cards to play with soon. Give her some, some Bowman. Hayden Fleury. That seems, that seems like, like, a, like the name of a hockey player. Another checklist. Um, since the Jaspies had some of it left over that they that they just didn't want, we've been kind of moving through like old inventory on eBay, basically. A Corey Schneider game jersey for the Devils. It's game used in an official. NHL game, not even a not even a fake one. I don't know. I mean, I don't, I don't see us like moving into into hockey for reals. A Young Guns checklist. Uh oh. It's gonna be a random. I mean, because like we'll never get like you know the cup and you know the good stuff. Out of 100, Frederick Anderson. I may have missed a number in the last one. I'm going to have to check.
Evgeny Shakokovavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavavav
All right, we're halfway through it. Damn, it's taking forever. Dennis Gurinoff for the stars. Samuel Morin, young gun. I don't know. I did say I think I could do without seeing another uh, birth. Well, I did not even watch, like physically watch that thing coming out. The process up to it was unpleasant. Robert Hag, 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 Alex Formanton, the Senators, Young Gunnery, UD Exclusive, Mark Let's to 200. Adrian Kemp. Kings, young gun. Will Butcher, young gun. Yeah. Yeah, 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 is a young gun. Hey, USA, USA, women's hockey, right? And I'm sure everybody stayed up to watch that. It's a, that thrilling game or match, whatever they call it. Sam Reinhart, game used jersey. For the Sabres. Yeah, I recognize some team names. I know some things about some stuff. Oh, now, he, now he's one of my favorites. Jacob. One of my faves for the Bruins. And when I hang out with him, we talk on the phone, and I just go by Jacob. I don't even bother with his last name because who, who needs it when you're that talented? You simply don't need it. Gabriel Carlson, on the other hand, you gotta you got to know that thing. No, baby is lovely, JG. Baby is lovely. If I was not here, I would... Probably just be at home staring at it. Or her. I still struggle with the pronouns on it. Ian McCaution. 
I mean, because let's be honest, like, as a, you know, tiny baby with, like, no, well, she's got blonde hair, though, oddly enough, like, light-colored hair, which my wife thought for certain she was going to have, like, like jet black hair like she does. But no, it took after me. Because I had light hair when I was little. But she just chills. She just hangs out. She doesn't do a whole lot. She's still learning to use her arms and legs and whatnot. Alex Kerfoot. Oh, I swear she's already like grabbing on to pacifiers and uh, boobs and whatnot. So probably most advanced baby ever. Victor Met Meat. Another clear one, Michael Grabner for the New York Rangers. I know he shoots left. He was born in Austria, so I know that much about him. Interesting. Interesting. Another Yamamoto. This one unnumbered. The Oilers. Okay, and we're going to move to our last box. Let me stretch it one second. I did hear we are getting new chairs for the office, which I am infinitely excited about as long as they have uh, arms on them so what I currently have to use is a joke Josh Hosang the Islanders. We haven't had one of the cover boys, right? Austin something. Another checklist. The CJ Smith young gun for the Sabres. Yeah, the Nashville Predators. This guy. I'm going to go out on a limb and say that he's international. Could be could be wrong about that, but I'm going to I'm going to stick with it. Double down on him being international. For the Blues, uh, he's, I think he's American. Tage Thompson. He was born in North Dakota. Arizona. Alright, I was close. West Coast. I'm going to take partial points for that.
Tyson Jost. Is he, a, is he a family member of Colin Jost? I don't know. We may never know. More checklist tree. Oh, yeah, that's... And last stack. The clear card, Luke Glenn Denning. He's from Grand Rapids, Michigan. The Red Wings. Anders Bjork. He's a young gun as well. Young guns. Okay, for the checklists, this is what we're going to do. All of them. Uh, if I, I'm going to roll one die, if it is odd, it's going to go to the left-hand side. If it's even, it's going to go to the right-hand side. Easy peasy. It is even going to all of the right-hand side squads on the checklist. Right. Thank you, everybody. We'll get this right to you.